Our police are still looking for at least four suspects who ambushed and robbed the 2015 Ironman Africa champion Frederick van Lieder of Belgium. He was out training on his bicycle in Port Elizabeth for next week's Ironman Africa race when he was accosted. His cell phone and sunglasses were stolen. Van Lieder was treated for slight injuries and has since resumed training. Ironman preparations are in full swing. Van Lierde determined to compete. He's not commenting on the incident, only confirming via social media that he's not pulling out. The city says security will be stepped up. We've committed ourselves to making sure we're going to ensure the safety of the athletes every day until the Ironman competition and thereafter. And we want our city to become a world Ironman training city so that people can come here and train and prepare themselves. So we are on high alert now. It's all hands on deck. We will guarantee the safety of our athletes, especially on the training routes. We will have high visibility and presence of police and Metro Police so that no other incidents can happen. And I'm sure we'll be able to make sure that all of our visitors that are coming to compete here will be safe over the next week and the weeks thereafter and next year. Last year's female winner Kaiser Lichtenun from Finland says the incident is unfortunate but won't be deterred. No, I really love this country and I really do, do want to participate anyway. And I want to give nice pictures from here in social media and so. But, uh, however, I was feeling a bit unsafe this morning. I can't deny it. And actually because of that, my boyfriend wanted to come with me do, uh, on, the, on my bike ride. And he was by car, so just to be safe. So, yeah. A second robbery took place on Victoria Drive yesterday, where Van Lierde was attacked. A local cyclist was also ambushed and robbed of his belongings. Jade Lee Paulser, SABC News, Port Elizabeth.